Okay, welcome everyone to Bribe with Thai, and today is Suksan Wan Krok Chin. It is Chinese New Year, the beginning of it, and we're at Kuk Som in Nokong Patom, and today is beginning with food that is being offered to the spirits and the ancestors, and then visits at the temple today, and a few other festivities which you will see in this video. So. Sit back, relax, and happy new year, year of the dragon. Here we have a traditional offering to the spirits that protect the house, the family house. These are the gifts that will be given to Cook's aunt and uncle and other relatives, you'll see more later. Here we have the offering table for the ancestors, and it's just getting started now with a few offerings being placed upon the table early this morning. This is going to be full in a little while. Stay tuned for more. This is another offering to all the spirits outside the house where they live. And this is sitting on the front of Cook's uncle's food cart, his restaurant cart. The incense is burning, and as you see, the offerings, everything from coconut to some o, which is pomelo, and a beer or two, some water, some kiwi, which is banana, the green banana, and some rice, sticky rice cakes and other things. Okay, my Chinese New Year breakfast begins with a bag of hot soy milk. Soy with uh, black sesame seed in it and what's called um, patanko, which is a deep fried Chinese bun. Very much like uh, a donut is what it tastes like. Slightly sweet and uh, nice and fluffy inside. You can see. Mm -hmm. Delicious too. Mm. Hey, Cook, where are you going? To the second floor to where our ancestors' pictures are. Okay. This is what are you doing? Uh, this is part of the offering on Chinese New Year Day. We offer foods to our ancestors with the belief that they will get to eat all of this. But in, in reality, uh, we eat all of it. After the ceremonies, we eat all of it. Okay, so you have noodles. There are more foods to come. So fresh food. coconut, pomelo. I even saw lots of treats here. It's a combination of Chinese cake. Foods, desserts, Water. This is water offerings, yeah. a glass of water before each of the ancestors' pictures. Cook's grandparents, uncle who passed away, mother and father, and another grandfather. Okay, now Cook is giving to Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Hey, this is Nampa, Nampa Tambalai. What are you doing? Okay, she's taking rice over here to the ancestors. Offering for each of the ancestors. Grandpa, Grandma, Uncle, and then her Grandma and Grandpa, Cook's Mom and Dad. And then also here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, 
Okay, so now the family begins to gather Cook's brother, F. His twin brother, M, is not here today. He's busy working. Over here you have F's wife, A, and Uncle Sanj. Everyone's preparing something. Honey, is this sunglasses or uh, eyeglasses too? Even though it looks like this. Yes, they're prescription glasses. This is F and he's bringing up the pork. <laughs> He's bringing up the sweet pork. Yeah. <laughs> now a prayer and offering of incense. <laughs> <laughs> Cook sang will burn six incense for each of the relatives. An offering of nam water. Incense and water and the food. And F is placing the last of the incense here. And now we're going to go to the temple to pay respects to Cook's parents. <laughs> By what? Okay, we have arrived at the temple where Cook's family members, including her mother and father, uh, are interred uh, where their remains are kept and we will pay respect to them today by making offerings of food and burning incense uh, yesterday or two days ago cook and i came here and cleaned so uh, cook and her younger brother f his daughter Fa, and his wife a are beginning to place the food offerings and the incense and everything there in front of her mom and dad's remains and her grandma and grandpa's remains which are kept here at this temple. Cook, what's the name of the temple? Okay, put put Thai. What we're doing. วันนี้มาวันนี้มาวันตกจีนมาแสดงความเคารพต่อที่ที่เก็บอธิของฟ้าแม่แล้วก็อาม่าก็ทำเนียมจีนก็คือเอาอาหารมาถวายแล้วก
thanking them for everything they provided her in her lifetime and to her grandma and grandpa as well too. Okay, now we are going to pay respect to F's wife's family, which is also in the same temple, their remains, with Cook's parents and grandparents. So behind me here, we begin to do that. Grandpa and her mom beginning to prepare things. And F and Cook helping out and, and Bri the tie, or Bri with tie doing the camera work. This is the donation here. Or no, I mean this is the food. Uh -huh. So, in a minute, we'll get to it. Okay, so as I said, we're about to feed the fish here at the temple. This is the fish food. It's like uh, day-old buns. <coughs> yeah, day-old buns or something. And Cook is talking to the Meshi, which is a nun. She's a Buddhist nun and she's telling Cook that the water here actually in this Klang is salt water. So we're of course close to the sea always in Thailand. So let's go see what the salt water fish want to eat. Uh -huh. uh -oh, so I asked her where are, can the fish eat this and where are the fish and she said they're coming because right now no one's been here to feed them so they're out in the open water so now with these buns floating here soon the fish will come okay, so back to feeding fish Cook just explained to me that no it's really not salt water but the salt water from the sea came up this far during the floods and it forced the freshwater fish out of the area and that's why the fish are very slow to come back and to eat this morning but some have started to take some of the offering that we've made let's see if we can find some more so here's the chunks of bread floating around and we're just waiting to see will uh, some fish come and get it. Normally when you throw this in here, the water just bubbles with these big, big catfish that come up and eat all of this. But as you can see, like nothing's happening right now. A couple came and ate one, but that was it. Manam, ma, manam, I should say, ma, which is mother, and nam, which 
which is water. So mother water is the word we use in Thai or words we use in Thai for river. So mother water, Manam, Manam, and this is the Manam, this river here. The name of this river I'm not sure of, but as you see, it's a big one, but big enough. Okay, so now um, this is the part of the day where we take all that food that was offered to the ancestors and we put it in our stomachs. This is the eating time and that's what we're doing. We are eating all of this food. What do we have? We have duck, we have pork, we have noodles, we have... Uh, the yellow seeds over there are lotus seeds. We have Japanese dumplings. We have Brian sneezing. We have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And I'm going to eat and eat and eat and eat. Even in this heat, it's about 30 degrees. But it's okay.